I think my favorite Halloween memory is that um, I used to go trick-or-treating in our little farm town. And my dad would, uh, when I get home, he would have me like empty out all the candy. And he said, I have to try one of each to make sure that it's safe. And I remember thinking as a kid, like, that is so sweet. I'm so lucky to have a dad who makes sure that every type of candy bar is safe for me to eat. And it wasn't until I was about 35 and, and he'd been, uh, he'd passed away about a decade earlier that I realized, what the f***? He was just eating my candy. <laughs> Rude. Truth is, I don't know that I have a favorite Halloween costume. I, I'm not a big dresser upper. You know, we grew up kind of poor. So it was always like I wore like whatever my brother wore last year. And then one year my mom like spiked my hair with gel and I was like, and gave me sunglasses. I was like, what am I? She goes, you're, you're a cool kid. You're dressed up like a cool kid. And I was like, as opposed to what, what am I every other day? And that's the day I found out I, I, I wasn't cool. <laughs> Happy Halloween. <laughs> this may be shocking, but I'm one of the small percent of people who actually really enjoys candy corn. It gets a bad rap, but like once a year, it's, it's just caramel. Everybody calm down. It's delicious. There, I said it. Am I a hero? Okay. <laughs>